Summer is no fun without a little vacation. Perhaps you'll be taking a drive down to Port A or South Padre. But have you checked your car to make sure it is ready to go? Roma, you're already try trying to do a road trip out there, I think, outside the studio. But before we take that trip, you've got a few tips for us, right? Let's go, let's go. Uh, yes, uh, Paul, I absolutely have some tips for you guys. I want to go on a road trip with North Star Boys tour bus. That thing looks awesome. Nanette, for now, we'll stick to the sedan. How about that? Let's do it. Let's okay. make sure it's safe. But the first step is, obviously, I buckled up, but we're not going anywhere right now because we're going to give you all the tips. First step is tires. Tires, yes. Tires, y'all. Did you know that you can check your tire pressure right inside your door? Right here, right, Nanette? Right over here, yes. You've got the tire pressure over here. Right here will tell you what your tire should be at. Okay, Okay. perfect. And why is that so important? Because you wanna make sure that you have proper inflated tires and that you do not have any wires or the uh, dry rod or perhaps your your tread is not where sure. it should be. Sure. So we have that little trick okay. here. Roma, there's your Guys, penny. Guys, Nanette taught me. Look at your penny. You know, a penny is good luck, but a penny can also teach you about your tires. Heads up. So you said? We put the head down. Okay. And if you could see the tip of Lincoln's head, that means you need to replace your tires because the tread is too low. Right now, I don't see the tip of his head. So I see for a little bit of the lower forehead and so that way the tire is good we can take these tires all right so we're perfect. ready so far for a trip okay and okay as a girl I'm always so nervous when I go and try to fill up my tires what's the biggest tip to doing it like I won't lose air right I was like well what we have now in the modern vehicles sure. is now a sensor inside the vehicle that will tell you whether you need air inside and I describe it as a little uh, looks like a horseshoe light upside down okay when that goes on that means one of your tires is out of pressure and then you want to take it somewhere and have them check it at that point. Okay, but this is what you use. Usually it's to fill it up with the air. Yeah, right here. Absolutely. Hey, tire filling 101 for my ladies out in the audience because I know the husbands do a lot of this. But not today, ladies. We can do it too. Absolutely. Now, second thing I would say is let's make sure we have a good, clean running battery. Okay. Take it somewhere. Well, first of all, let's make sure there is no... Uh, anything acid coming out or the battery's not swollen okay we want to take it somewhere and get so ourselves wait, a, a check. battery can actually get swollen it gets swollen when you it gets, know it's like like just oh yeah bigger? it's on its way out if okay. it's getting swollen it, with okay. this heat okay they get pretty bad good to now know. we need to take it somewhere have it checked you need to have them check that as well as your charging system your your alternator as well okay okay and what's next now we always want to make sure we have our oil we want to check our oil okay. right guys always on a flat surface yeah is what my dad always said, on a flat right? surface this isn't started in the this is how you check it, but right now we can't check it because we okay. don't have it on a flat surface. Okay, I okay. got you. Now also, you the cooling system, I'm going to tell you, is the most very important thing. Especially? Yes, <laughs> with this heat, obviously you can yes. tell. Um, so we, uh, you can't see the radiator right now, but if you do have an exposed radiator that you can see the cap, you never want to open that ever when it's hot. Okay. You should leave this stuff to a professional. Sure. You have an overflow bottle okay. that's filled with coolant. Okay. Now, if you see that low or something, that's going to be a huge indication that you need to get your system checked. Sure. Now, you could take your, your vehicle in to a shop, ask them to do a road service, you know, kit trip for sure. you where they're going to check it around. Most importantly, ask them to do a pressure test. So what they do is they'll pressure test your system, your cooling system, and if there is, they put in a lot of pressure in the vehicle. If there are any leaks whatsoever of antifreeze, It'll we're come. gonna find it with that test right away. That and we so can important. fix it before you leave and run, drive off with a busted hose. You know how you see in the movies, the radiator bust off and yeah, the cars going the road, all over. Asking for a exactly. hitchhike. You don't want to be hitchhiking on the road. No, no. Not with the kids, Absolutely. especially not. Yeah. <laughs> and gasoline, make sure your gasoline yes, is full. Yes, your gasoline Wipers. full, you know, you're better to drive in the morning you know in okay. the daytime we want to make sure our wipers are nice and clean and we don't have any tears oh. you know what I mean you want to have a good clean surface when you're you're driving okay. and one of the other important things that I, I really love to tell people is to get yourself a couple of these cloths take a vinegar based Windex and clean the inside of that Windex and I mean soak it down okay. clean it really good then take a brand new rag and polish it because okay. that will keep you from any issues like when you put your defrost and yeah, stuff and you know how you can't see yeah. yeah it's going to keep that from happening all right well, well. O'Brien's Automotive people can come check you out anytime right yeah you know what they could come and get a free roadside check from me oh, if you want to okay. come by i'll even put your system under a pressure test and we'll make sure that it's safe to go and that's no charge okay oh brian's over on hebner so hebner road yes ask for nanette newgart thank you for thank all these you tips, so nanette. much appreciate oh, it we are ready to go and road trip yeah with
right, North Star right. Boys tour bus yep. and Nanette and all of us. There but we but go. Where are we going? Well, where I know, are we going? That's what I was going to say. Where are we going? I got my food. I'll bring the food and we're ready to go. So now you know what to do before that road trip. And you know, when the heat gets like this, well, you got to take care of yourself as well. It is 